Hey everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude. Happy Father's Day. And this is going to be my DVD update. So I just went to Entertain Mart and I bought some movies for very great prices. The first movie I bought is Terminator Judgment Day. The second film, of course. And look, 349. Holy crap. And it's a huge box set as well. Just want to show you guys very quick. Look, there's a booklet. Look at this inside. Uh, and then there's this inside. So, $3.49 just for all of this. And I think that's really awesome. I'm glad I bought this film for a very great price because I love Terminator 2 Judgment Day. This is actually my favorite Terminator film. It's just so action-packed. The storyline is great. It was just a very nice conclusion. And then they had to make... The shitty third film, honestly the worst film in my opinion. There was no need to continue the franchise from here. And then we have the fourth one in which I can understand why people don't like it, but I personally enjoyed the fourth film. And of course I am looking forward to Terminator Genesis. But this one right here, magnificent. And of course the first one's really good too, but the second one, holy shit, it's even better. It's one of the best sequels I've ever seen, actually. I'm so glad I bought it. The next film is Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl. And I got this film for only $1.99. I really like this film. This is an awesome original film. It's the thing that starts out the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise. I personally have fun with the franchise. Well, four I could have some fun with, but it's just an alright film overall. The fourth film is the weakest, but this film, two and three, I could have a lot of fun with. And if I'm not mistaken, it's the first Disney film to ever be rated PG-13. Johnny Depp is great as Captain Jack Sparrow, Jeffrey Rush, Orlando Bloom, Kira Knightley, everyone here is fantastic. Action sequences filmed so well. There are nice comedic moments going on. So Parts of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl, Arrgh mateys. I just had to get these lenders right here on DVD for only $1.99. Arrgh. Next one I got is Night at the Museum, the original film for $2.49. I really enjoy this film. Two was alright, but this one I actually did like right here. It's a fun family film. Ben Stiller was funny here. Everyone else that was involved in the project did a really good job. Dick Van Dyke was surprisingly in this and that was surprising when I first saw this film because I wouldn't expect Dick Van Dyke to ever do a film like this since he is a very respected actor. But it was enjoyable seeing him in this film. And of course, Robin Williams, Owen Wilson, Steve Coogan. We have a lot of great actors in here. And Night at the Museum overall is funny and a lot of fun to watch. And I know there's going to be a third one coming. So I hope the third one could be at least just as good as this first film. And be a little better than two. Because two was sometimes enjoyable to watch. But it definitely could have been a little better. The first Night at the Museum though... I'm glad I own it. And now the final film is actually a blind buy. I haven't seen this before. I only got this at Entertainment Mart for $1.49. And that is the Mandy Moore and Matthew Good film, Chasing Liberty. I blind bought this film because I really like Mandy Moore. I like Matthew Good. And I've heard from some people that it's a very cute film. So I actually did want to check it out. And I figured since it was only $1.49, that I could just, you know, blind buy it and just see what I think. I mean, come on. It's Mandy Moore. Just look at her. That's all for my Father's Day DVD update. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Comment below and tell me your thoughts on Terminator 2 Judgment Day, Parts of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl, Night at the Museum, and Chasing Liberty. Subscribe, like, and share. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Also, you guys, I did make a Father's Day video called Movies to Watch for Father's Day. It's where me and other guest stars I bring in that video tell you the one movie 
we all think is great to watch for Father's Day. I hope you could check it out. I'll leave the video in the description below. I had a lot of fun editing it all together and it was just something I really wanted to do for Father's Day. And I hope you enjoyed this Father's Day edition of DVD Update. Happy Father's Day to all of the fathers out there. Make them feel loved and special not only on Father's Day but every day. And uh, thank you to all of the fathers that are serving in the military right now. We appreciate your service. I am 22 Tiger Dude and don't forget that I will always have... TIGER POWER!